the live study channel today i am going to discuss c interview question and answer it's not a whole part of the c but just few topics i am going to discuss so let's start my first question is what is a c language so basically c is a middle level language and procedural programming language the proce procedural programming language is also known as the structured programming language is a technique in in which large program are broken down into a smaller module or task and each module is used in structure code is in structure code so in in c is a general purpose programming language created by means developed by denis richard okay denis richard in in 1972 where is in bell library bell laboratory bell laboratory okay it is a very popular language okay but c is strongly associated with unix c is associated with c is C is associated with Unix. Unix means Unix is a operating system, open operating system, developed in C language base. Okay, is very important question and in a C, right? So there are some points I remember means. Unix, okay, and developed in nineteen seventy-two by Denis Richard. In which laboratory? Bell. laboratories okay and also also the c as a mother language c is mother language means A C language is considered as the mother language of all the modern programming language because most of the compiler, most of the compiler, compiler like JVM, Java Virtual Machine is a full form of Java Virtual Machine. Okay, kernels written in C language. written in c language and most of the programming language follow c syntax for example c++ java okay and c also okay another question is why is c language as a mother app i think i have i think i have already discussed okay so it's a important point also is it is provide the core concept like array array string function file handling etc are used by the many language c sharp java and also 
function function is called in C language but in a Java it is called method file handling means output input okay why is C called a middle level language middle level programming language so C is a considered as a middle level language because it is support the feature of both low level and high level language but C language programming is converted into assembly code it support pointer arithmetic pointer arithmetic means low level pointer arithmetic but it is a machine independent a feature of high level so there are two types which is type means low level and high level so a low level language is a specific to one machine either machine de in depend it is machine depend fast to run fast to run but it is not easy to understand but in a high level language it is not specific to one machine now this one is specific to one machine either machine independent it is easy to understand easy to understand okay easy to understand another point is what is the feature of c programming language so in a c programming language define in a various part define in various parts there are three ten parts means sim simple machine independent are portable middle level programming language structure level programming language rich library memory measurement fast speed pointers recursion and extendable so just i am discuss one by one point means first point first point is a simple simple means since a simple language in the sense that it provide a structure approach to break the problem into a parts means small small parts and the rich set of library function in function data types in function means data types okay data types another point is portables portables means unlike assembly language c program can be executed on different machine with some machine specific changes therefore c is a machine independent language c C is a machine independent language, right? Note down point this one. C is a machine independent language. Okay, then. Another point is structure. Okay. So structure set defined is a simple is a simple uh, first of all note down in note down in the feature. is a simple and machine so machine basically independent means first of all you 
definitely is a specific language so so okay machine invent language okay and another point is mid level programming language means sc is in, intended to do low level programming it is used to develop system application such as driver kernel it also support the feature of high level language that is why it is also known as the low level language and another point is structured programming language means structured programming language is the sense that we can break the program into parts using function so it is easy to understand and modify the function also provide code reusability okay in a code re re is built in okay and uh, rich laboratory means provide a lot of inbuilt function that make the development fast rich programming means lab library means inbuilt function inbuilt function memory management means it support the feature of dynamic memory location in c language you can free the al allocated memory at a time by calling the free function free function means calling in a memory management free free function then fast speed speed means the comp compilation compilation and execution time of the c program is fast since there are lesser inbuilt function and hence the lesser overheaded but in a pointer a pointer provide a c provide the feature of pointers we can directly interact with the memory by using the pointers we can use pointer for memory structure function array etc but a recursion in c we can call the function within the function it's provide code reusability for every function recursion enable us to use the approach of breaking points but in extendable extend ext, extensible because it can easily adopt new feature new feature so there are some point about the c programming move to another point another point is explain the compilation in c so so basically there are some compilation means pre processing first one pre, some states means first one is the pre processing compiling assembling assembling then assembling then linking okay there are some features means suppose this is one source code source code extend the source extended source code then assembly code then object code then executive file there are some points so one by one i am discussing the first just i'm little bit explain about the compilation so basically the compilation is a process of converting the source code into object code it is done with the help help of compiler the compiler check the source code from the systematical or structural error and if the source code is error free then it generate the object code object code means means machine so in a comes in a 
in a C compilation process, convert the source code taken and input into the object code or machine code. The compilation process can be divided into the four steps. Means, first step is pre-processing, compiler, assembler, and the linker. So, just discuss one by one. One by one. First, is, first point is pre-processing. Pre-process. Preprocessor means the source code is a code which is written in a text editor and the source code file is given an extension C dot C means given extension means suppose I am saved my program is not hello dot C okay the source code is a first pass to the preprocessor and then the preprocessor extend this code after extending the code the extend code is passed to the compiler so second step is compiler compiler so the code passed to the compiler and then code which is extended by the preprocessor is passed to the compiler the compiler convert the to assembly code compiler convert to the assembly code assembly code or we can say that the c compiler convert with the pre process proceed code into assembly code okay then after assembler assembler assembly code is converted into object code assembly code converted into object code object code by using an assembler the name of the object file generated by assembler is the same as the source file the extension of the object file in a doc means which type of means suppose hello dot obg okay and in and in a Unix, the extension is O. If the name of the source file is hello.c, then the name of the object file would be hello.obj. Then up, after go into the linker, means the mainly all the program written in C use library function. So linker is a library function. Note down this for good. Okay. Library function, other object files also. So this library function are pre-compiled and the object code of this file is stored with the dot library extension the main working of the linker is to combine the source code of library files with the object code of our program sometimes the situation arises when uh, when our program refers to the function in other files the linker play a very important role in this it's link the object code of this file to our program. Therefore, we conclude that the job of the linker is to link to the object code of our program with the object code of the library file and other files. So, output of the linker is the executable files. The name of the executable file is the same as the source file, but differ only in the extension in DOS. The extension of the executable file is .exe and in Unix, the executable file can be named as dot a dot out. For example, if you are using printf function in a program, then linker add its associated code in the output files. Right. Another point: C syntax through the program. Just one by one, I am explain. Explain means what is uh, conclude uh, uh, has include studio dot h main print up and return one by one okay so through the flow diagram so basically so basically in has 
dot include means has a include means studio dot means is a header header file library standard output header file library it's a work with the input and output function output functions the main the main is the curly function any code inside the curly braces it will be executed printf is the function to output print text to the print and print function used to print data on the consoles so is a return zero statement execution status to be operating system zero value is used for the successful and one is unsuccessful executions but in a in a flow diagram just hello just i actually i just previous i will i have already discussed means hello dot so including the main functions in this code program then you move to the first step is a preprocessor means header file okay then move to the intermediate file means hello dot i means intermediate okay then second step is a compiler compiler save to the hello dot s okay then assembly code file to assemble assembler and similar clock with object file object means hello dot object then move to the linker if file also step linker linker also called the execute execute file to execute the file hello dot execute file is this type is a machine code okay then output program this type of okay and printer function and scanner function is what so the printer function is used to display output and the scanner function is used to take input from user the printer function and scanner function are commonly used function in c program these function are in in build library function in header file of the c programs but some important points about the printf means the printf function is defined in a standard output input output header edge using the functions we can print the data or user defined message on monitor also called consoles but printf function can we print the different kind of data format on in output string another point is a printf can be print on a new line on the screen we can just consoles just add has n print of statement syntax suppose in a print of functions print of functions just format means in a print functions a specific dent argument list but in a scan of is used to read input of consoles the functions build in function variable in a c library dot scan of function can be read character string numerical or a data from the keyword in a c language but scan of is read the formatted data from user and assign them in the variable provide the additional argument additional argument must must point to a variables that have the same data type as our user input from user data format means suppose suppose in a one program my cursor is little bit difficulty but suppose main functions suppose data type is integer num n number then print okay and the uh, scan up percentage of the just little bit
just wait one by one just just wait just using in one program so wait okay means include at it may number okay print enter a number then scan of percentage of d what d is a input is a data types means integer and 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 is number then print of cube is number yes i am writing in this one either okay 